Well, it's the place people go to fix their problems, not just to get more medications for them. And you can go there and see if they can help for absolutely nothing. Look at some of the results. Fantastic. They do all the work. They tell you what your options are, and they're the Institute for Functional Health. And Dr. Brad Nevorowski is a clinician there. And good afternoon. So Hi. tell us more about you, you fix the problem, because a lot of people think fixing the problem is you do it with medication. Right, and that's the common uh, theme that's out there. But what we want to do is not just add more medications, just the correct numbers. We want to get to the true cause of the problem and find out what's driving it so that we can actually do things day by day to help fix that and see health improve. So this is, as we kind of use the example, it would be like having a, a wound that doesn't heal. You're not just putting more Band-Aids on it. You're going to figure out how to make the wound heal up better, right? Exactly. And that's why we'll look at things like lab work to be able to understand what's going on or what people are doing in their day-to-day -day routines that might be throwing their health off. And that's going to give us clues and information on how we can actually help and fix the problem and give them a better quality of life. And this is for somebody that it's just something just is not feeling right. You're just off. A little bit, right? People can have digestive issues, poor energy, not sleeping well, reflux, heartburn, um, hormone imbalances. You know, if they just don't feel as good as they think they should, you know, that's your body telling you there's something not right. And uh, one of your patients, Kelly, and I believe we have some pictures. What was going on with her? Uh, she had a whole host of different things, and she was one that was on several medications. You know, she had reflux. Uh, it was affecting her ability to sleep, even though she was on a CPAP machine. And once we start affecting sleep, you know, it's going to affect your hormone levels, your energy levels, your ability to think clear. Um, so it just kind of all snowballs and cascades. But the medications were only helping some of the numbers. She wasn't feeling better. Okay. Kelly is joining us right now. Good Hi. afternoon. Hello. So what, uh, what was the process like, and, and how do you feel now? It's like I'm, I'm feeling great now. The process, of, I was always tired. I was with my sleep, losing mm -hmm. sleep, even with the CPAP machine. I just had no energy, and I just didn't feel good. So instead of just medicating for it, what did they do to fix the problem? Uh, worked on the diet and also supplements that have helped me a lot. What kind of supplements? So she on now? Uh, we do things to help support, like for people who have uh, sleep issues, you know, she had a little bit of mm -hmm. blood sugar, cholesterol, so vitamin D, help them with the adrenals to help the body adapt better. Um, they're all just going to be supportive things in addition to what we do with the diet and other lifestyle factors that when you do these things consistently, you're going to see building a higher and higher level of health because you're adding to that health quotient over time. So the thing that comes to mind is the old saying, you really are what you eat. Majorly, you, yes, and, exactly. And, and like you said, she's on supplements too, right? Yep. Vitamin supplements yep. and things? And supplements do supplement what we do for the diet, so yeah. And this is all done from basically blood work. Yep. Yeah, she had things like low vitamin D, low cortisol, uh, labs as far as the cholesterol, blood sugars were starting to creep up, so it gave us a great opportunity to catch that early enough make the corrections, and now her goal is going to be starting to reduce the medications. You have a deal for our first 20 callers or texters, right? We do, yes. The first 20 are going to get a free consultation so they can come in and see if we are going to be able to help them. And they're also going to get our free e-guide, uh, Fountain of Youth, which is what pretty much most everybody's looking for. Okay. Well, first 20 uh, SA Live viewers to call the Institute for Functional Health. We get a free consultation and a free guide on how to find your Fountain of Youth. Just call or text the word INFO to 210 987 8971-210-987-8971 for more information on the Institute for Functional Health. Visit their website, ifhealth.com.